almost made it pain free. Says it's the end of time, and the dark man can survive. But what if it's can't survive? The industry will survive. All right, we're out here early again all water's edge story start early we've been on the road for about an hour and a half heading to fremont michigan to lake ryerson and we are going to be doing a very nice easy dock install for the ymca camp echo up there we are pretty excited to get this thing in the water it's going to be pretty considerable size and uh, we actually have the unique opportunity to work right hand in hand with these camp directors and uh, maintenance crew and or counselors to kind of get their hands on this equipment and uh, show them how easy this easy dock actually is to install. There's not many um, not many snags with easy dock. You don't have to level it or anything. So it gets, I'm projecting it to go smooth. This is about my 10th one that I've consulted on. So. What if a part gets dropped? We've got extras. That's what I like to hear. I cannot wait to get there and get this thing going. I'm really excited to have you guys tagging along. And I just love showing you what we do and the whole industry, what Water's Edge is capable of, and especially when it comes to pairing up with Easy Dock. This is what we're starting with on paper. You tell us from home if we end up with this by the time we're done today. I parked up there last time, but this is definitely the only Is that easy dock right there? <laughs> oh yeah, that's a nice load. They have boxes down there already. A ton of them. Starting to get ready to unload. Beautiful, beautiful, nice still glassy water this morning too. Oh cool, they got the other dock out of here already. Will we just be coupling them in the water or? Yeah, I'm, my, my brother's gonna be okay. the, the one to okay. orchestrate that. We'll see what, what he thinks, but I believe it's gonna be pushed out, yep. coupled, pushed out, coupled, and then once we get a certain amount, move it into place and it should go really, really smooth. Yeah. So we'll unstrap <clears throat> and then Garrick brought fork extensions. So, Perfect. and I mean, we just take our time. It's not like yeah. we're in a huge rush. The, the ones up top are gonna be the hardest um, to get off. And then yeah, after that should be pretty easy. Awesome. And did you, uh, do you want these straps pulled all the way Did out? you bring the ladder to or were you gonna measure that? We've had a couple surprises this year where I get a load and it's like, we didn't get our float step ladder or our bench. And they're like, oh, that's on back order. They don't really, me ahead of time but i'm sure it's all here do you see any pal do you know if there's any five step ladders on there <laughs> all right that's me Well, it's going good. We're getting there. These are going to be our runs going out in that drawing that I showed you previously. There's a pier going out on the left and a pier going out on the right. It's going to be a six and a half foot wide, which is I think a foot and a half over ADA width, all the way going out. And then we'll have a span of 60s coming across, kind of making a big U shape. But this is going to be quite a bit beyond what um, we usually do with our runs going out. They're going to have so much, so much room on the dock. I like it.
We're off to a pretty good start here. They are unboxing right now. We've got our couplers stacked up, which that's the most labor intensive part of it is putting in these couplers. Sections are all down to the water, almost all down to the water. And uh, then we're gonna start connecting. One section at a time, connect it, move it out, connect it, move it out, till it paints the picture I showed you earlier. That's the plan anyways, we'll see how it goes. So if you want to get a couple guys with hammers, and just knock just those. start knocking those through. Okay. Do we got more hammers? That's a good hammer. Right yeah. tool for the job. Jake, that's a pipe. <laughs> Pull on the back side of it as you're hitting it. it just seats itself in there. It is this first this first uh, piece mealing everything together is a bit of a chore, but after this it's literally the easiest dock system you could ever put in. Don't yes. be afraid you're gonna break it. Whoever gets the most done is hired, which means you get to work with us for till November. <laughs> Water's Edge tip. Anything can be used as a hammer, except for a screwdriver. That's a chisel. Anyways, we eventually did find some more hammers, passed them out to the crew, and they immediately formed an assembly line without any direction at all. So I just want to say thanks to all the volunteers. You guys all did an awesome job, and you can come work for Water's Edge any day. So when is the official start of Memorial Day weekend? We have family camp, so we have about I don't know, 30, 40 families that come up. Uh, and then June 6th is when we have our first group of Awesome. Oh, look at that. All right, everyone, listen up. Dear Easy Dock owner, the Easy Dock team thanks you for your purchase. We know that you had other choices of docks, and we appreciate your decision to purchase Easy Dock. You'll find it easy to maintain your easy dock. <laughs> so how we're going to do this, these circles here are those pipe brackets right there. So there's going to be two there, two there. So this is the pipe bracket. Okay. That's the, the pipes that are up there, they'll slide through it and anchor it to the ground. Yeah. So there's two, four, six, eight, ten. So what we're going to do is we're going to build that, we're going to build that, and we're going to build this, slide it out there, and hook them together. Okay. So that we can get our, get our distance. Perfect. Um, sure. Does anyone feel any left out while I'm drawing? I got two more. <laughs> I like looking like if I know what I'm doing. Mm, beach. I know that one. The easiest way to do these, which yeah. is a little bit more lifting, is to get one on the beach like that and then get one on this side of it and pop these, put the couplers on, lift the section, drop it in, and then you slide the section out. sections in went extremely smooth this stuff surprises me every time and I've been doing this for multiple multiple years we've got a group of five or six helpers here this is the first time that they've assembled this stuff and to watch how quickly they catch on just the way this stuff is manufactured and how it comes together quickly and easily really exciting to see so this is this YMCA is a nonprofit organization this is not something they're doing to make a ton of money these people are coming together to help men and women individuals of all walks of life um, to get out here and enjoy the water, enjoy the lake, 
and what a cool spot and, and how how blessed Water's Edge was to be able to work with YMCA and be a part of this. Very, very cool. So the next step is to take the poly pipe brackets that are gonna fit right in these pockets beneath me here and auger in some pipes to hold the stock in place. It does not use the pipes as support whatsoever. It floats a lot of weight. This section we're standing on floats a couple thousand pounds easily, if not more. You just pick your pockets, you put in your uh, pipe bracket, send the pole down and it keeps everything exactly where it's supposed to be. Stability, check that box. Safety, there is not a single sharp corner. No steel ladder with sharp edges. No wood to get splinters in. We got all that handled. I'll tell you one of the bigger things though is gonna be the ease of install and removal for these uh, camp counselors and volunteers that help put this in and out every year. Night and day difference between the old raggedy wood dock. So this is a win. It's gonna be a good year for them. We're very happy to do this. Hey, thanks for the help guys. Hey, no worries. Yeah. Thank you, appreciate it. You're still it. in the water? I'm still in the water. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, did an awesome job. Have a fun summer. The install went real great today. Jerry and the team were super helpful, had everything we needed to, to get the job done. Uh, docks look great. We're really excited to get some kids out there this summer and have some fun and stay safe. The most ambitious gang we've ever had help with these Oh, guys. you're talking stealing one for a crew? Yeah. Yeah. Gross Point Yacht Club stuff. We're doing a boo show in the midst of all of this chaos. Oh, you are? Yeah. Not the easiest lifting, Doc. Easy install. Wish we would have brought a trailer, but... See ya. Everything's always a mess at the end of install. You're like putting a bunch of shit in the truck, bolts and nuts everywhere. But well, well, I was very, very happy about that. I love working within these camps with the volunteers and stuff. So now that there is easy dock there, rather than not looking forward to putting the dock in, it's just one more little step towards summer. They, they have something that's gonna last 20, 30, 40 years. I mean, it's a one and done scenario. And uh, it's gonna bring a lot of joy to their YMCA campers for, for many years to come. We're on our way back home now, and uh, can't wait to maybe take a stop later on in the year and get to see some campers using it and enjoying the lake. Quick thinking on that soccer mom. <laughs>